The world economy is entering a deep recession, probably the deepest since World War II, and even deeper than that seen in 2009 after the financial crisis. This slump is guaranteed after the coronavirus forced countries around the world to impose lockdowns. That's forced businesses to shutter and workers to stay home. But what does the recovery look like? Nobody is quite sure. Much depends on how the virus transmits throughout the Americas and Europe, and how long it takes to get under control. But there is some evidence from previous cycles that allow us to guess at what the recovery will look like this time. The hope is that we would have a V-shaped recovery, a deep dive and a deep slump in US and European economies in the second quarter, like the one seen in China in the first quarter, but then a fast rebound as companies got back to work and employers were allowed to return to their places of work. Government stimulus that we've seen throughout the world would drive that rebound. Now economists are starting to worry a little bit. They're wondering more about a U-shaped recovery, one in which the slump is deeper than was first imagined, and then it takes a while for companies to get back online and for workers to feel that they can go back to their jobs. They might have some debts that they built up during the crisis and they'll need repaying before they feel good about spending again. So that means a longer period of recovery than first imagined, but then a pickup perhaps into the start of next year. It's a bit like what we saw in the financial crisis of 2009. The L shape, which we saw in the Great Depression, which is a sharp decline in, of, and loss of growth, and then a very, very long recovery, perhaps well into 2021. There's also the chance that we see a W. That would happen if the virus returns. So we have a period of recovery when it passes, but then it comes back towards the end of the year and that prompts another slump as companies and workers are forced to stay home again. The non-letter shape is a swoosh, a bit like the Nike app logo. In that, growth slumps again in the second quarter in the major economies, but then starts to pick up a bit slowly. So instead of a, a U or a V or even a W, we start to see more of a tick shape as companies and workers slowly return to work. 